Good day, people. Cooking with Can Cooker. I'm your host, Seth McGinn. Thanks for tuning in to another one. Today, we're gonna make a firecracker shrimp. Stay tuned. It's gonna be poppin'. Mmm. We're gonna turn it up a notch. We're gonna make firecracker shrimp on the new conversion griddle. Let's get rolling. Two tablespoons butter. With butter, I like to add from an old buddy of mine, some vegetable oil or olive oil. Today we're using olive oil. So we'll just get this melted. This thing heats up quick. So easy to use. Look at that even heat distribution. Throw a pad here, 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 here. Now, if you haven't checked it out, check out Party Cracker Seasonings. Can Cooker website, we're gonna incorporate a little on here. This is quarter of a pack Can Cooker Party Cracker. And then I like to add a little bit right on the griddle and we'll get these popping with the party cracker, firecracker seasoning. So just let them simmer on there. Doesn't take long at all. Woo, smells firecrackery. Oh, look at that. Mm-mm, good. When people cook shrimp, in my opinion, the majority of the people cook them too long and they'll get rubbery. It does not take long at all. I mean, as you can see, these were not on there maybe 45 seconds. Give them a little flip. For this and more great recipes, make sure to check out cancooker.com. Let's get these plated up. <laughs> 